Tonight, Action News Jax investigates is getting answers about the rollout of body cameras to JSO officers. I'm John Bachman. I'm Tanika Hughes. There are now 380 officers wearing body cameras, and that's up by 170 over the past three months. Action News Jax, Jenna Bourne joins us live in Englewood. And Jenna, you've learned what parts of town have the cameras rolling and which ones are still uncovered. Inside this Englewood convenience store last week, a JSO officer shot and killed a man they say was armed with a knife. Surveillance cameras inside the store were rolling, but no body cameras were. That's because we're standing in zone three, where zero officers have been assigned body cams. 380 JSO officers have been assigned body cameras since the sheriff's office first began rolling out its program in October 2018. Since then, there have been six officer involved shootings in Jacksonville, including 38 year old Jerry Marrero last week. There wasn't any op other option for police officer Santor other than to discharge his firearm. JSO can't confirm whether any officer involved shootings have been captured on a body camera. I caught up with Jacksonville Police Union President Steve Zona. What do you say to people who are frustrated by that? Sure. Well, we would like to have them caught on camera too because we, like we said, we, we don't oppose them and we firmly believe that these cameras are going to show what we've been saying for years is 99.9% .9 of the, the stuff we do is done correctly. Since the official rollout began, this is the only body camera video JSO has released to the public. <laughs> showing what led up to a JSO officer shooting a pit bull to death. By Action News Jack's calculation, only about 19% of JSO officers and sergeants have been assigned body cameras. You have to realize that they have to take these officers off of the street um, and send them to class to be trained to operate these body-worn cameras. JSO has rolled out body cams in Zone 1, which is the downtown Springfield East Side area, and Zone 5, which is the Northwest Newtown Baldwin area. JSO is currently adding body cameras to Zone 4, which includes Riverside, Avondale, Ortega, and the West Side. That leaves Zones 2, 3, and 6 uncovered for now. JSO plans to add 250 body cameras every quarter until every police officer and sergeant has one. It's expected to take two years. Reporting live in Englewood, Jenna Bourne, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jax.